Hi, welcome to KTV5 video tutorial. Now the drill bit in KTV5. Let's have fun with KTV5. I will start in the generative shape design environment or workbench because I need a helix. So let's go for helix. And in the starting point, create a point and that might be three millimeters on the y axis and the others would be zero. The axis would be the set axis. The pitch should be 25 and the height should be 60 and well yeah, that's okay. Very nice. Now let's activate our part body, make it define a work object and switch to the part design workbench. I need a sketch on that plane. Hide as usual the yellow projected elements. That would be a circle and add some constraints. This would be 6, and that point should be coincident right here, and of course on the other axis as well. Leave that sketch, and make an extrude, uh, maybe, where is it, there it is, and that should be 80 millimeters. Now, I could just copy that sketch, copy and just paste it, Control v go to that sketch 2, cut part by sketch axis, sketch plane, sorry, and view normal, okay, I need another circle, and that would be two in diameter. That point should be on that axis. Coincident. And distance should be 2.5. Then I need a line maybe like this, and you could snap the tangency, trim it, this should be trimmed and that should be trimmed, and the distance from this point right here to the y-axis is 0 0.5. Leave that sketch. Now that sketch is still selected, so if you go for a slot, it's already there. The center curve would be this one. And profile control not keep angle but pulling direction and the pulling direction would be that plane so it uses the normal to that plane that's okay and confirm now i need a pattern so go for circular pattern i need two with 180 degrees the reference element would be the set axis, okay, and I don't want the current solid, but I want to pattern that slot. Let's take a look. Looks good. Next, I need another sketch, maybe on the Y set plane hide those yellow projected elements as usual. 
that would be rectangle and I don't want these H and V constraints so I will delete them add some dimension constraints or just dimensions this would be 10 that distance would be 18 those two lines should be symmetric allow symmetry line to the set axis yes and that distance from this line to that axis should be 80 leave that sketch make a pad make it mirrored and make it 0 0.5 to both sides now add some fillets first 2 millimeter on this edge that edge this one and that one and another four fillets with one millimeter on this edge that edge this one and that one confirm and I'm almost done I just need again the face uh, sorry it's German word and the English or American word is camphor so go back in time go to pad one and make a camphor make it length and angle yes make it three millimeter and 45 degrees and the object to camphor would be that edge Good preview and okay very nice and now make the part body the object and I'm done so hope you liked it if you liked it please give it a like leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook cat fan page would be mer would be very nice of you thanks for watching see you to next one bye bye